Okay, hello team, and welcome to today's how to. All right, so what we're going to go through today is how to set up the funnel. All right, so obviously, with the passion app, all right, the app is good for getting your workouts in, the app is good for getting your content on, content on the app is good for community, many different things. All right, it's not, I wouldn't say it's the best for selling because it's not. A sales page, all right. So obviously the sale, the sales page at the beginning, all right. Don't really use that a lot. I right? just have a few things on there. Maybe a link to one of the free parts which is inside the app. The rest of it is all done inside my funnel. All right. I'm I'm driving as much traffic as possible to my funnel each day. In the aim of a lot of the times is using a lead magnet, getting leads or obviously selling people, sending people to the sales funnel as well. Now, depending on what you do, right, there's 101 ways you can set up your funnel. All right, so what we're going to do today, it, which is, it's been a way that's worked for me quite quite well. All right, so that's what we're going to go through. Um, as I said, there's many, many different options you can take. And I'll, as we go through this, I'll explain a few for you. All right, so the number, first one, is using a lead magnet now the lead magnet what we're going to do is we're going to give out something free to get the email address all right and once we get the email address all right we then can get them into email marketing build trust set yourself as the expert and from that area then add in little cells or in turn send them down to your sales uh, your sales funnel for your main product all right so what i currently what i do and we will put and i'll do this on the video as well when, I, when you make it is i am currently giving out a few ebooks from that once i've given in given their email address all right they then go through to the next page a lot of the times a lot of people say send them through to a thank you page all right but what i do is i send them through to an order page with a small salon all right see who's interested to immediately straight after they've given their email address all right what can we get them to buy part of our packaging um so i i do a small sell with a 14 day uh, challenge and from up um, from there they then go to the thank you page now if they go through and they don't want to do the small sell all right then they've got the link to download their Lead the lead magnet on that page, or if they do, then as they go through to the thank you page, they can get the app download, uh, login details, etc., and and send it over. You can also set up email automation to send it over the um, the lead the lead magnet. Now, what I do from that point is once it's gone through with the lead magnet, I right, they automatically go into a series they go into an email series which is a welcome series and um, it's however many emails long emails long building up um building up a rapport you know we're getting to know you i explain about me explain what we do ex I put client transformations on um you know put stories in there all leading up to then coming on to something to then at the end of it it all leads up to coming into either our bigger package, our membership, or another aspect. Now, a lot of people within doing a passion are looking for their um, their launch. Now, what you could do is your lead magnet, get them into an email series, and then do the launch that way. So every single person who comes through goes through a launch series. So you could go, you know, you get your lead magnet, say, for instance, an ebook, go to a small cell, yeah, whether they do that or not, but then, moving to the thank you page to go into an email service which then launches the new product and you know by the end of that it's I mean, towards the end of the emails you start to go right here we've got the email launch or we've got the launch of this new product send them over to the sales funnel you more emails over over the next however many days over to the order page all right so that is another way to do it as well. So you're always doing that launch, all right, but it's done through an email campaign instead. Now, obviously, um, the other email, so the other funnel is a sales funnel straight through to the order page. Once I've bought on the order page, we're going to get either a one-time offer or an upsell. 
with and then over the tether or not, we go through to the thank you page, which then also sets them up, sets up automatically onto the app. Login details sent over. All right, and it's that it is that simple. All right, so they are the two funnels that we're going to go through. As I've mentioned, there are many, many different ways that you can go through this. All right, you can do however many lead, lead magnets you want. You can do different sales funnels, you can do different pages, you can do upsells, you can do downsells. All right, but just for ease, all right, what we're going to do is we're going to go through the lead magnet. I'm going to go through a lead magnet that I use myself um i'll go through the small cell um, and then also onto the thank you page and then what i will do as well is i'll build a sales funnel for one of my programs through to the um, order page all the way through and then from that point i will show you how to integrate it all within Z within zapier onto your passion app so all links uh, smoothly go through how to set up automations within um, email responders putting tags on so they immediately can move through one point to the next okay awesome well hope you've enjoyed that if you've got any questions feel feel free to reach out 